Hi, this is how to configure Internet Explorer to be able to work with a CCTV system. Basically, we need to find the settings and they're normally under the gear icon in the top right. So we'll click that and then at the bottom we'll see Internet Options. And in there, the first thing to check is to go into Privacy and make sure that cookies are enabled at the medium level. Indeed, there they are, set to medium already. If we had to change it, we'd move that slider, then click Apply. So that's all correct. Next we go into the security settings. First of all, we're going to look at the local intranet. In clicking sites, we check that automatically detection is switched on. Then we check that the security level for that local intranet area is set to medium low. If we have to change it, we need to go into custom level. And in custom level, select medium low, click reset, and click yes, I do want to change that. So that's medium low settings on local intranet and we've just applied them. Next we go to trusted sites. Now we need to add our site here so we click sites and this will add our web our DVR CCTV system as a trusted site. So our particular IP is 192.168.186 but you may have something different and you may well have a dynamic DNS address if you're accessing from outside of your network check that HTTPS is not ticked, click add and then scroll down to ensure that that address has been added whether it's IP or DNS check that it's been added. So that now is one of the trusted sites we click close to come out of that. So we now need to set the security settings for this trusted site from medium to medium low. So we'll select custom level again for this area. We select custom level and we select medium low, reset, and again we'll be asked to confirm yes, I do want to change these settings. And then when we check that we're happy with that, medium low, reset, yes. and then click OK and then click apply to apply all of these settings okay so let's visit our CCTV system now and see what happens we enter the address again whether it's IP or DNS we enter the address all CCTV DVRs are different this one we click on a button here and then it asks as they all do to install an ActiveX control that's what we've just enabled we've just told that this trusted sign is allowed to give us this pop-up and ask to install this software. This one's called Riffatron. We click install because we do want that to happen. We then allow uh, anything from 5 to 30 seconds or so while it downloads it across the internet depending on the speed of our connection and on the speed of our browser. It's now downloading the software and installing it and then we will see our CCTV system pop up. There we go. So we need to log into our DVR we use the PIN code and username that's already been configured on our CCTV system uh, for remote access. We click OK and we should log in and get some live footage now. There we go. Got live CCTV system appearing within Internet Explorer. So in summary, Internet Options. We check that the cookies in privacy are set to medium. We check that the trusted sites and local intranet have our site added and that they're both set to medium low. As you'll notice the main internet, the rest of the sites in the world are still medium high so we haven't compromised the security of our web browser. It's still secure when it looks at other websites. We've just given this a trusted site status that has its own special settings.